It was the straight edge community that really opened my eyes to what was really happening and saying, you know, it's not okay. It's not okay to abuse and murder animals for your own joy and detriment, not benefit. I remember distinctly being a child and realizing that a hot dog is a pig and a hamburger is a cow and being pummeled by it and being upset because I liked cows and I liked pigs and they were nice and I didn't want to hurt them. And I remember my parents saying, no, it's okay. And that's all it took, being a baby. I think it's, it was a very natural progression for, for punk rock to embrace vegetarianism because punk rockers are very conscious and they're very mindful and they actually are very compassionate. The whole punk rock community came out of resistance and a need for sanctuary. Our sustenance came from stopping at grocery stores and getting soy milk out of the little hippie section and buying cereal and just pouring it in our mouth so we didn't get the, because you didn't want to buy a bunch of bowls and you couldn't really afford to, so you pour the cereal in the mouth, pour the milk in the mouth. And, 